But I mean, having said that, I, I think we're very confident going into game two just because um, we've had a little bit more time to prepare. We obviously, we can see what we can do better after game one. We watched a lot of film um, and we did a lot of good things, but there's a lot of things we need to improve on. So I think we're ready. What do you think you've learned most in your playoff experiences so far? Um, every possession matters. Um, it's it's really tough to go out there and kind of, you know, let plays go and not be locked in on every single play um, because, you know, one play here, one play there could be the turning point in the game and the series. So uh, just trying to be locked in and as much as possible is, is, is tough. How much are you enjoying it? Oh, I love it. I love it. It's playoff basketball is it's the best time of the year. It's just like, you know, in college and the tournament, March Madness is the best time of the year. And um, anytime it's winter, go home and everybody's playing as, as hard as they can. And um, with all the competitors on this team, how hard we play, it's just it's just a lot of fun. It's the best time of the year and you know, we're all having a good time. How do you balance that, uh, you know, urgency of needing to pick up a win on the road with not getting too tight? Um, I think we've been here before. I think this team has been in the playoffs before. This, this coaching staff does a good job of preparing us for that. And um, you know, at the end of the day, it's basketball. As much as you want to say it's playoffs, and it's you know it's a different game. And like I just said earlier, every possession counts. But I mean, we've been playing, we played 82 games of basketball this year, and uh, we're, we're we're well prepared for whatever is thrown at us. And I think mentally, we're everybody's locked in. We're not we're not tight. We're not worried about the stakes. We're just we're just ready to play. Um, he's as good as it as as good as it gets. I mean, he's there's no fluff to it. There's no you know magic to it. I mean, he he comes in and he works on his game, and he's one of the best players in the league. So um, just to see that and, and know that all it takes is work and dedication. Um, it's it's pretty cool. You know, you see a lot of superstars in the league. You, you grow up watching the NBA, you see superstars, and you kind of always think maybe they're just they're destined for it and this is kind of what they were going to always be but and I think there's a little bit to that but with Dame it's just how hard he works he's one of the hardest workers I've, hardest workers I've ever seen so there's just no secret to it which is it's pretty cool and then obviously as a leader um, he treats everybody the same um, he doesn't have an ego and that's really all you can ask for for your best player